In this video, I'll demonstrate how to register your athlete in Register My Athlete. First, after you've signed in and you're in your parent account, you want to click under where it says Parents on the link that says click here to start complete athlete registrations. You'll then want to read the terms and conditions of use. You can do that by clicking on the Show icon and then clicking on the Here link. Once you've completed reading this, you want to go back to the previous screen. If you do agree to the terms of use, then you want to click on the I have read and agreed to the terms of use in privacy policy selection, and then click on the submit button below. On the welcome pop-up that opens, you can either choose their own tutorial by clicking OK, let's go, or you can click on no thanks. I'm going to choose no thanks. The first thing you want to do is click on the start complete registrations link here on the left. I'm going to say OK to this pop-up, and then where it says new registration, Click here to start a new registration. Click on that. Along the top ribbon, you'll see your status of these steps. The first step is to select your school. And then choose your state. And then go ahead and type in the school that you'd like to register. And as you type, you'll get options that will appear below. Go ahead and select the appropriate school. Now you'll see a check mark next to select school. And a new option appears below it to select athlete. So I'm going to click on that next. And then in the pop-up, I want to click on the Add New Athlete button. And then go ahead and fill out this form, especially the required fields that are indicated by an asterisk. You'll need your athlete's birth certificate or passport or other in order to verify your athlete. I'm going to choose birth certificate. And then I'll fill out the rest of these fields. Once you've reached the bottom of the form and filled out all the required fields, then click on the Submit button at the bottom left. You'll see that there's a check mark next to select athlete, and now you need to select a year and sport. So first you want to click on the academic year, and then you'll see more options populate below. In my case, I'm going to choose volleyball, and then click on submit. Then you'll get a pop-up to confirm your selection. If everything looks accurate, then click on the button, I have selected the correct information. Then you'll see a registration successfully started. I'll demonstrate the next steps in another video. Thanks for watching.